Who knew it would take nine minutes to make cheese? Hmm. It's fast. What is up, guys, and welcome back to more Genshin Impact. We are being Detective Beto again in, in helping uh, Ayaka out, um, but we need to get a hold of some silk for the uh, for the merchants over here. And let's go ahead and we let's go ahead and face the correct direction to go and get some. So hope everyone's doing well, by the way. Um, hope everyone had a good Thanksgiving as well. Along with that, let's see, can I? Can I make it past that? No? Absolutely not? No? Ah, oh, okay. Hold on, where- where are we going? Let's look on the map. Okay, we're heading right- okay, just- Just take that fast travel point, let's just do that. Let's make it so much easier on ourselves. Hey. Here we are. This is where we were robbed. Hey! Look on the ground! What are those? Oh? Uh -huh. Footprints! Very deep ones at that. Leading towards the forest. Hmm. Presumably, the depth suggests that they were carrying something heavy. Let's see where they lead. Heading into the forest, huh? Okay, let's do it. I'll bite. What do we have here? Oh, I need the uh, electro electro element things. That thing right there, right? I think it's that thing. What's up? Okay. Nope, can't do it? Okay. Oh. Okay, that works. I'm cool with that. Exquisite chest. Nice. I'm all starting to lose way. count. Ah, this thing, the relay stone, right? Isn't that right? Ah, uh, okay. I still gotta figure out those relay stones. I had someone that told me um, about them being important for for like puzzles. So let me hold on. I see this thing up here. So, yep, I got that. There we go, and take that. No? Oh no, that doesn't work, okay. Hmm. Hello, sir. I don't think you're who we are looking for. Let's go ahead and Continue on our way. All right, I'll come back and figure that out at some other point. Let's see, we have this. They went this way. All right, you scoundrels. Aha, these look like bandits. Stop, thief! <laughs> you think you can get your stuff back with this bunch? You must be dreaming. Why, you? You better hope you have the courage of your convictions. Why wouldn't I, old man? Answer me this. You're one of those outlander merchants, right? You trade association types are worms. Coming over to our land, leeching off our people. Who's gonna leap to your defense, huh? Tell me, who's gonna stick their neck out for the likes of you? <sighs> Look at that. No response. You know I'm right. Face it. This is Inazuma. You've got no ties here. You're at the bottom of the pile. Can you really blame us for walking all over you? You are despicable. Hey! I just had an idea. Since you came all this way, how about we do some business? Business? Pay up, and you can take your fabric back. Sound good? If you ask me, it beats walking out of here with black eyes and a broken nose. <gasps> You're just a big bully! I... Uh, what choice do I have? 
Uh, you have Wait. us. We can Mr. kick their butt. Kurisu, please do not pay any money to this man. But, but. I trust you remember our agreement. If you keep your lips firmly sealed, I too shall uphold my end of the deal. Oh yes, of course. Then please stand well back where it is safe. Now, it is time for me to honor my word. Ah, oh, we're gonna get a tryout, Ayaka. Yes, we are. Oh, nice. Nice. That's kind of cool. So rude. Oh. Whirling snow. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep freezing them. Uh, retribution. There you go. Oh uh, yeah. That's all right. Gotcha. Get out of here. No. I wonder why they're another test subject. They're uh. Tingle. My apologies. Voices are all messed up and stuff. I must leave no stone unturned, as a dutiful maid would. I'm just gonna keep messing you up here. Take flight. Yeah. 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 We got some more Fire incoming here. Uh, picked. Well, that's resolved then. <sighs> no, please. I. It was nothing. I was simply doing my duty. Miss Komisato, traveler, are are you hurt? Don't uh. worry, we're fine. <laughs> I wouldn't worry about us. The vagrants left in quite a hurry. It would seem they didn't have time to take anything with them. I believe your stolen goods should all be here. Thank you. Thank you so much. You'd best do a count. Six, eight, ten. Yep, it's all here. Get it out of the rain, quick! <laughs> Great! Now we can finally buy some silk! Buy silk? You mean you need some of the silk here? This was indeed our intent. Don't get us wrong, though. That's not the reason we helped you out. Even if it were just a few carrots or cabbages, chances are we still would have helped you get them back! Paimon thinks we're pretty lucky. If we arrived any later, our chances of getting Silk and Inazuma would have been zero. I honestly can't thank you all enough. Please, say no more. You need Silk? I'll pick out a piece for you right away. Thank you, good sir. How much do I owe you? Oh, it's free of charge. I could never ask you to pay after everything you've done for me. <laughs> There's lightning going everywhere oh, around no, us. That will never do. Things cost what they cost, and what they cost is what I shall pay. Merchants already have enough challenges to deal with, and as Paimon explained, my help was unconditional. Please, sell your wares to me at the price you would sell them to any other customer. There is nothing to feel distressed about, because nothing... I repeat, nothing happened here in these woods today, did it? Thank you, I... I don't think I could ever repay you. You have helped me greatly and I will never forget it. I'm... Uh, I'm afraid we must part ways. I must get these goods back to the Association. If you ever need anything at all, just come to the International Trade Association and ask for Kurisu. Very well. And thank you for the silk, Mr. Kurisu. See you then! Bye! Safe journey home! Don't go getting robbed again! Don't jinx them. <laughs> Traveler, thank you for stepping in to help out. But how come those vagrants didn't seem to know who you were? They must move in completely different circles. Maybe they've never seen anyone from the Kamisato clan before. Perhaps. Either way, I'm glad they didn't recognize me. The fewer people who know what happened today, the better. <laughs> it 
It's not every day an important person like you helps out someone like Kurisu. It really shows what a great person you are. Oh, uh, your praise is quite unwarranted. I merely did what anyone in my position would have done. I admit that it did feel strange for me to come to his aid. But this should have nothing to do with identity or social class. As far as I'm concerned, it was one individual helping another in need. I guess that deep down, I don't see how a society can be considered just when people encounter such obstacles in their livelihoods. Uh, sorry, I'm getting off topic. Right. Let's head back to Ogura Textiles and Kimonos and give our hard-won silk to the shopkeeper. Okay! Cool. Yeah, that's what it's all about, you know? Someone needs help, help them, you know? Real simple. Oh, there's those guys. Okay, anyways, let's head back to Inazuma City. Yes, right there. And let's progress the quest. I love the colors in Ina Inazuma. The purples and pinks are really pretty with the blue and everything. I I really dig it. You know, I, I've really liked pretty much everywhere in Genshin Impact. Everywhere has its own appeal to it, for sure. <gasps> now, let's do this. Hey there, we're back! Welcome back! So, any luck at the International Trade <clears throat> Association? Did they have any silk in stock? Yes, they did. Here. Excellent news! So, apart from the silk, I think everything else I need I've got in store already. Uh, I just need to go and take stock of our materials. It won't take me a moment. I'll be right back. They better all be there! I do hope nothing else is missing. Traveler, on the subject of garments, I've been meaning to acquire a new outfit for you, too. It's just, I wasn't sure how you'd feel about the idea of dressing in Inazuma in attire. Oh, are you sure? <laughs> Is that so? Impressive. So travelers of your stature hold themselves to a dress code, as well as a code of conduct. Hmm, more like when you're away from home, you've got to live by certain rules to survive, whether you like it or not. But Paima would still love to check out some Inazuman outfits. Just what is that supposed to mean? They make them in whatever size the customer asks for. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your interactions are so adorable to watch. Um, I mean, um, I can certainly find someone to tailor a Paimon size outfit if Paimon so wishes. Hmm. Well, if you're sure, as you wish. Something else I've been wondering is how do people in other nations dress? Hmm, that one's a tough one. <laughs> we'll say stylishly, because it's stylish for the area. They sure do. Each nation has its own unique style. Traditional, fancy schmancy, casual, all very different, but each style is suited to its region. The study of clothing is a profound discipline, and I still have much to learn. When clothing becomes part of the expression of one's personality, even an extension of one's body, that is quite a wonderful thing. So I am not against dressing up, Far from it. Paimon agrees. You couldn't have put it any better. Paimon, you're so adorable that you could wear anything and it would look lovely on you. Wow! <laughs> Paimon just got a compliment. Don't let it get to your head. <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. I've checked my inventory. Thank you. Is there anything else you're missing? Fortunately not. I have all the materials I need. As for the size, would you like me to go by the dimensions given on the design? Yes, please. Understood. I'll get to work shortly. In total, that'll be... this much. Here A wave? you go. Is it possible <laughs> to treat this as an urgent order? 
Well, luckily, we don't have any other urgents at the moment, so I can begin work right away. It will still take me some time, though, so please come and collect it later. Until then, I'm sure you'll find somewhere nearby to pass the time. Good idea! Let's check out the whole area. We don't want to leave any loose ends. <laughs> there will be no loose ends while you're in my company. I already decided where to go while we wait. For our next stop, I'd like to take you both for a meal. Food? Oh, Paima likes this plan. Mm-hmm. I picked the venue especially for you. A humble local eatery called Kiminami Restaurant. I thought that the relaxed atmosphere there would suit our day much better than the prohibitively formal one of a high-end restaurant. Shall we head off? Yep, yep! Paimon can't wait! Cool, let's do it! Alright. There we go. It's right down the road, not too far. I like having this little, little bird guy with me. Dropping in. <laughs> Are we here? Ooh, it's one of those street side places. Looks cute and cozy. Welcome. Oh, Miss Kiminami. How do you do? Oh, Miss Kamisato. Perfect timing. Your booking was for. Well, right now! I believe so. We'll be sticking to the order I placed in advance. As for the other matter we discussed, thank you for your help. Excellent! No problem. And everything you asked for is ready and waiting. Traveler, tiny customer, please wait here for a moment while I prepare your food. Tiny customer. Go ahead and take a seat. There is something I need to take care of, but I'll be back momentarily. <laughs> <clears throat> It's nothing of that sort. I just have a few minor things I need to attend to. I won't be long. I like that I instantly sure go. In a hurry. Is it a fight? Whatever is it a fight? It, is, it must be pretty urgent. <laughs> so you two are Miss Kamisato's friends? <laughs> well, we serve all the classics. Sure, there are fancier looking places out there, but the food here speaks for itself. Hope you enjoy it. Over the years we've been in business, we've gotten to know the Kamisato clan quite well. Miss Kamisato and her brother are both fond of our food. They're always sending staff down here to order something and take it back to them. Her table booking surprised me. Not least because it was a group reservation. This is the first time I've ever heard of Miss Kamisato going out for dinner with friends. The first time ever? Oh, guess that makes us pretty important people, huh? Sure does. And I'm probably crossing the line here, but I'm just telling you what others have told me. Apparently, Miss Kamisato doesn't have a lot of friends. How is that possible? She's so kind and polite to everyone. Paimon would have thought that would make her really popular. That's what I used to think too. But it turns out the rules of social interaction are a bit more complicated than that. Nobody in the neighborhood has a bad word to say about her. They all say she's beautiful, elegant, graceful. Not to mention that she belongs to one of the most illustrious clans in the land. In short, they see her as a model young lady. But that's just it. People look at her and they see a model of perfection. And they don't feel like that's something they can relate to. So the majority of kids from our ordinary families don't even try to talk to her. So you see, on paper, she sounds like a girl everyone would want to get to know. But in practice, she finds it difficult to make friends. Oh, Paima never would have guessed. We don't speak all that much, but we do go quite a way back. I've always admired her for taking on so many responsibilities at such a young age. So it makes me really happy to see her here with friends today. Anyway, relax, enjoy your meal, and please talk to her as much as possible. I know she'll appreciate it. Consider it a favor for the whole neighborhood. Look after her for us. <laughs> Like <sighs> I'm 
I'm so sorry, traveler. <laughs> yeah. Could you join me over there for a minute? Um, I need your help with something. I'm sorry. I didn't want to drag you away all of a sudden. I, um, just had a cooking catastrophe. Oh, so that loud noise we heard came from the cooking pot. As you can see, this house is right next to the restaurant. It's where the owner lives. Actually, this whole compound is the family's private property. I asked Miss Kiminami to prepare some ingredients and utensils for me so that I could cook a special dish here. Right! If there's something you want to eat, you could just order it from the menu. Actually, I wanted to cook something as a gift for Tsubaki. My mother mentioned in her notebook that Tsubaki enjoys food from all over the world. So I thought, if I'm going to meet Tsubaki, perhaps a dish from overseas would make a fitting gift. A dish from overseas? So anything from outside Inazuma counts, right? If so, then we've got lots of options, don't we? <laughs> Could say my food is out of this world. <laughs> hey, don't make this weird. <laughs> Can I leave you to finish this task then? Just as a personal favor. Is that okay? I'll be indebted to you. Great. But what kind of overseas dish would make a suitable gift? It needs to survive a journey from the kitchen to the recipient's doorstep. Oh, Paimon knows! There's one dish out there that was practically created for this purpose! Fisherman's Pizza. Toast? Pizza. Pizza? Ah. It's an assortment of toppings and sauce spread over a bread base and cooked in the oven. And it's so good. That does sound pretty good. All right, I guess we're doing pizza. Let's see, what do we got here? Can we not cook? Meat lovers, mushroom pizza. Okay, we need... Is that flour? Okay, flour. And we need cheese. Okay. Can I process any of this stuff here? And process flour. Okay. Do I... Do I have a pizza? Is the pizza ready? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> All right, let me go find a uh, a goods. Oh, let's ask uh, Kimi Nami. Hi, traveler. So strange to see Ayaka looking flus. Oh, okay. She can't sell me anything. Let's see. What do, do we have? Anything on the map here? Aha. Right. There. Uh, I didn't mark it. What the heck? Okay, hold on. I got this. Select. Confirm. Okay, well, we're just gonna kinda go up and... And, uh, go see it for ourselves. See if we can find it. For some reason, I can't really mark it. There it is. I see it. Alright, give me cheese and flour. Oh, a lot of recipes, huh? Okay, they do have flour. So let's um, go ahead and just buy a bunch of it. Sugar. No cheese though, huh? Or or even um, or even milk. Do you sell milk? Ah ha ha! Do you just sell cheese? Nope. Okay. 
Let's buy some milk. Ah, that should be enough. I'm just, I'm just winging it here. <laughs> okay. Here we come, Ayaka. Okay, let's... Let's do some cheese. Ah, oh, nine minutes to process that? Okay. Well, in that nine minutes, why don't we run around and... <laughs> Let's go and find, um... Find some chests. That works. That works pretty good for it, I'd say. Kind of a bummer, no one sells... No one sells cheese just outright. Oh well. What do we got going on over here? We got kids? They're not guarding a chest, though. Uh, we got an Electroculus. Let's get it. <laughs> Hello, sir! Oh. You have a, uh, a boss thing on you. Ah, uh, you're not much of a boss, though. To the fairy! I think we defeated him without him even laying a hand on us. Okay. Where have you been hiding? That works for me. What else we got? Oh, we gotta find yeah. that Electroculus. And there we go. Punishment. Melt, yes! Okay. Damaged mask. Oh, you guys are picking a fight with me, huh? Okay. That works for me. That was retribution. Overloaded. you. To ashes. Perfect. There we go. Perfect. Becomes the hunted. Yes, it does. I suppose this will do. Hey, what do we got up here? I don't know if I've been over to this little area. Let's go see this guy. Oh, what's up? Oh, time to melt. Oh, he jumped off the edge of it. He committed suicide. <laughs> I suppose this will do. All right, I'm following you around. Amakane Island, huh? I said that huh? weird. Island. Hi, island. Amakame Island. Yes. <laughs> Boom. All right. <laughs> there you go. I suppose this will do. Oh, did it just bring up that chest? Okay, got it. What do we have over here? We have this. Which means I probably have to go... Let's find out where I need to go to bring in that guy. Oh, we have some shops up here. 
A food vendor? Do you have cheese? Festival snacks. Oh, he... I can't buy anything from him, huh? Alright, where is that Electroculus? Is it up top? There it is. This looks like a job for... Venti. <laughs> as much as it pains me to bring Venti in. <laughs> Alright. Give me a moment to go... Oh! I can't quite reach it, huh? Okay, let's try this. Almost there, and... Yahoo! There we go. Got it! And we have a chest. Sorry for the rude way to gang, everyone. Oh. <laughs> you can't run. Lights out. Out to sea you go. Oh, not quite all the way. Okay. That's fine. Stained mask. What do we have here? Don't I use, uh... Use that electro thing for that? I think that's what it is. Hmm. Better than nothing. Oh, we have a, uh... A thing over there. A dungeon, if you will. Let's go unlock it really quick, actually. Let's bring out that Wave Rider. Where's the Wave Rider again? It's right over... right over here. Here it is. So it took me the longest time to figure out this is how you... how you get around, is the Wave Rider. <laughs> I was like, how am I supposed to swim to the other islands? I have no idea how I'm supposed to do that. <laughs> This is how. Hello! Let's follow you around really quick. Grab some crab. And there's an Electroculus here. Rain. You know, we never got that other Electroculus. Could cleanse the corrupt this shows how distracted I get in this game. <laughs> Where'd he go? Did he go up top here? Huh. Yeah, he did. Hey, there's the Electroculus, by the way. We'll come get that in a second. Better than nothing. Come on, get off the rock. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, let's get that Electroculus. Should probably be grabbing as much stuff as I can as I run by it. in the world get, get me the heck out of here <laughs> there it is It's a ley line disorder, okay. 
Cool. Let's, um, let's check back with Ayaka, see if we've... We've, uh, used up enough time to let that... ...kinda settle. Become cheese. Who knew? It'd take nine minutes to make cheese. Hmm. It's fast. <laughs> Wait. Is the pizza ready? Hold on. No, it's not. Not yet. Processing time. Nine minutes. Wait. Is it almost done? Or is it not going at all? Oh, do I just have to sit here and let it do it? What? No, that's lame. Okay. Let's keep doing our, our thing. Um, let's see. You know what? Oh, did we knock some wood off that? I'll tell you what. Let's, um... Since we can't do the cheese, maybe this episode, let's go ahead and let's see if we can complete that. What is it? Um, level four or floor four, and see if we can get um cole. Yeah, let's do it. Let's start it. My usual team, absolutely. Just so I'm not dragging you guys along and <laughs> we're sitting there waiting for it. Elemental Mastery, uh, Defense plus four. We'll do Elemental Mastery. <laughs> Retribution. I'm glad y'all have come. Has a good night, shoot. Steady as stone. <gasps> Oh no, I'm frozen, okay. You know what? Burn. Will you knock it off? You! You are really annoying. I must leave no stone unturned. You! <laughs> no! Retribution! Oh, I pointed out the wrong guy. Where are you? There you are. Oh my gosh! Oh no! And I'm frozen! This is kicking my butt! You! Ah, oh, come on. That's crazy. Okay. Seriously, though. <laughs> oh, man, there's another one. Oh, come on. Punishment. Leave it all to me. Time to clean up. Yeah, I'm not gonna let you do that. I'll catch up. There it is. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, let's continue it. Why not? Elemental skill damage. Let's definitely do that one. I rely pretty heavily on those elemental skills. Eyes 
on me! Yeah! Yeah! Ah, uh, there's one of those abyss mages. No, sir, I don't think I will let you do that. Get out of here. You. Die. Ah, oh, there's another one. I must leave no stone unturned, as a good knight should. <laughs> and to Luke. Retribution! Zarya, freeze him in place. There we go. Got it. Nice! Very nice. Let's continue that. And elemental burst plus 20% damage. Ooh. Ah, let's try that. All right. What are we doing? This guy, this fool, right here. No, I don't think so. Oh, you are lucky you dodged that one. Oh, so lucky. <laughs> oh, man, no. No. Freeze him in place. Seasons greetings. That's ridiculous. Judgment. Next. There it is. <laughs> All right. First half. Um, I guess we'll just keep doing my usual team. Oh, it must be at least one member. Wait, what? So let's remove Noel. Okay, and then second half. There it is. We'll do... No, we can't do that. Okay. So let's do Traveler. <laughs> um, I don't have... Uh, I mean, we can do Candace. Sure. Oh, this is floor five. Got it. You know what? Um, can I just... Can I escape this place? No? We gotta try it? We gotta try it. Okay. Hello! Retribution! Leave it all to me. Time to clean up. You can't run! Oh. Eyes on me! Punishment! Verdict is... Burn! 
Come on, gotta kill him. Uh. You. Judgment. Light out. Oh, I should have brought that down. This guy. You can't run. Okay. On the other side, I'm gonna fail this. <laughs> oh, it's gonna fail so badly. Thunderclap! Lightning flash! Time for takeoff. Hey, get him! Let it rain! We shall prevail! Take this! Oh, man. <laughs> Oh, I died already. What? No. That's dumb. Oh, these guys are powerful, huh? I don't think I'm going to win this one. Do your worst. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, there goes Venti. Okay. The wire is broken. Well. Oh man, this doesn't work. This doesn't look good. Tired. Oh. Is their health just constantly going down? Yield. And the shield. There it goes. There it goes. Broken. Yep. I had a feeling. <laughs> Let's leave. Let's leave. But we should be able to get Cole, right? Everything's ready. Yeah. Sweet. I dig it. And then I can take a look at her ready. constellation and see, uh, see how that is. And let me, um, let me grab my rewards really quick. Wait. Hey. I need my rewards. Uh, we'll abandon it? Okay. Oh, I was so close on that, huh? <laughs> so close. I'll have to go back and finish that that first floor at some time. How how am I looking on my primal gems? Cool, I'm getting up there. I'm definitely getting up there. Anyways, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. I want to thank everyone for watching all my videos. If you are enjoying it even just a little bit, please hit that subscribe button, hit the bell notifier, and smash that like button so I know you're enjoying it. And I will continue to make awesome videos for you. Other than that, we should have the cheese that we need for that pizza in the next episode. And then we will finish it then. So I will see you guys there.